would you believe that a farmer would no longer require fuel for his or her power thresher for crops or paddy de husker or artisans will no longer have to manually operate their pottery wheel or the physical labor involved in weaving can be significantly brought down the answer is yes and the way forward is through renewable energy guwahati on thursday witnessed a workshop that showcased several solar powered machinery that will help boost livelihood and self sustainability in rural northeast the workshop demonstrated solar powered instruments such as pottery wheels blacksmith blowers slicer machines paddy threshers paddy transplanters spinning machines and several others organized by the ministry of new and renewable energy along with selco foundation and the association for renewable energy agencies of state the workshop aimed at strengthening local economies and improving the livelihoods of rural and last mile communities while focusing on the agriculture and allied livelihood sectors we have come together to bring all of the state nodal agencies across the eight northeastern states um to try and see how we can build program pipelines for decentralized renewable energy led livelihoods um in this particular event we have also brought together livelihood departments from agriculture sericulture uh, handloom as well as horticulture departments uh, and agencies like nabard and the state rural livelihood missions because we believe that a lot of these different departments are already the undertaking activities for livelihood improvement it may be in the form of trainings and capacity building it may be in the form of market linkages it may be in terms of financial and credit linkages we want to be able to leverage that so that the dre for livelihood scheme that is likely to come out soon can build on the work that is already happening and that we understand what initiatives are already underway within each of these states and build on that to be able to replicate and scale these solutions It also saw the participation and discussions between stakeholders and social enterprises over business models, typologies, mapping convergence opportunities and several others. So uh, this uh, program was organized in uh, request from MNRE where they wanted to uh, meet the stakeholders from various states in the northeast to come up with a scheme or some, some programs for the like uh, dre like dis de decentralized renewable energy so and discuss this uh, the problems and challenges in the states and in the northeast and kind of get an idea where uh, everybody shares their kind of view and come up with a scheme which can be actually benefited to the people of northeast so in this event we have people from uh, all the eight northeastern states along with some of the farmers who have actually successfully uh accepted renewable energy as their kind of uh, source of energy for their livelihood and uh, this will be, this is a day long event and uh we also will be including some uh, demonstration for various uh, like uh, renewable energy uh, run livelihood solutions in the demonstration gallery where the uh, respected guests will have a walk around through the stalls Uh, the chief guest for this event is the senior director from MNRE, and uh, along with some other directors and other uh, department officials from the various northeastern states. So we have been working with Selco Foundation on DRE solution for uh, about eight years, and today I got a privilege to come and meet the stakeholder from different um, departments from all over uh, northeast state. So uh, it was uh, really nice uh, to be at this event, and we look forward in more collaboration in the days to come with the uh, state department. Today we are here to basically work and develop the ecosystem that is needed for DRE. We all are doing everything in bits and pieces, so it's time actually to join hands, where department uh, organizations are from different government departments. the state nodal agencies of the ministry and the csos and the entrepreneurs everyone comes together collaborate and jointly take forward the dre march in the northeastern region don't forget to like share and subscribe to east mojo for any queries put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications